Hi there! This video will show you how to copy your students from your contact sheet over to the advisory participation sheet. And the advisory participation sheet is the sheet that you're going to use to keep track of the participation of your students in your advisory class. And that was shared to you, with you in the YMS COVID file, or folder rather. So right now I'm looking at my pretend uh, contact list. And so I have all my students listed here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click uh, and drag down. You can go in either direction. You can start from the bottom and go up. And then I'm going to copy it and I'm gonna use a shortcut. If you're using a Mac, you would use Command C. So I'm gonna hold out the Command C, uh, key and then press C quickly. And so now I know that it selected that area because there's a dashed line all around it. Now I'm going to find that file that I was telling you about. So I'm going to go over to my drive and then I'm going to click on the shared with me section. And so here I'm going to look for that folder. Now I have a bunch of thumbnails here. So I'm gonna go ahead and go over here to the list view and click there so that I can see it a little bit differently. Um, and another thing I'm gonna do is because they're, they're all out of order, so I'm gonna click on name. And so it should organize it now by, by name in, in alphabetical order. You know what, I'm gonna click it again so that It'll be in reverse alphabetical order and because I have a lot of folders and it'll be easier for me to find it. See, there's YMS COVID right there. So I'm going to go ahead and click there, open up that folder. Just waiting for it to load. Okay. So now we have three, these three folders. Now, if I go back over here, now that icon has changed from a list to a grid view. So I'm gonna go ahead and click there just cause I like that view better. And it's probably what you all see too. So um, you're gonna find the file in the resources folder. So I'm gonna double click there. Wait for it to load. Okay. So now you're gonna find it in the advisory folder, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and double click there. And then now I'm gonna revert back because there's like a lot of files in there because I created a file for every one of you. Um, I'm gonna go back to list view just so it's easier for me to find. Okay. So you probably won't see everybody's file in there like you do on mine. Uh, you'll probably just see your own, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and open my own. It says Duran right here. Okay, and so this is the advisory student participation sheet that I was telling you about. Now um, here um, is where the student name uh, will go. So I'm gonna click on the first cell that has, uh, that's blank rather, and where it's gonna begin. So now I'm gonna use a paste shortcut, which is command and the letter V like Victor. So I'm gonna hold down command and then press V quickly. And there's my names. And so now when I want to uh, take note of who participated in my advisory class, then I can just click on the check mark box Okay, for all those that, that participated. And then you'll do that for every Monday. So the date's up here, and you'll just do that for every one. Now I noticed that this cell box has a, a border around it, and it's probably gonna bother you the way it bothers me. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that cell, and over in your toolbar area, you'll see this icon that looks like four squares together. So I'm gonna click on that, and then hover over to the one that has no borders. So I'm gonna click there, and so now it disappeared, okay? So remember that if you need any help, feel free to contact me.
Thanks.